Right, load a game. And we're in the Pride Lands. I remember this boss going horribly wrong the last time you tried this. Yeah. Good. Ha. Yes, because you didn't know how to use reflect last time. Ah. Well, I don't know. It's, uh, it's probably on my hot bar because you told me to, so let's go. Yes. And no, you don't need to do it during the run section or with the feet. You only need to do it when you get on top where the monkey head is. Because yeah. that thing can do an electric pop, which can one shot you. Get on top of the monkey head. Back out, back. We need to go back to the boss arena, which is out. Okay. To the Savannah. Yeah. There we go. This is a hot This is a lot of next game. Okay, so when you when the boss spawns, it will be a running section. Mash triangle. Okay. Just keep mashing triangles to get a bunch of ones. Now you target the eye and you go nuts. Attack, attack. Yes, there you go. And now you need to knock it back down, which is a go to the legs, and there should be a thing where you can get on top of it. There should be a reaction. On one of the legs, and do it fast enough. Where you can jump on top and hit the monkey. Energy. And this is where you need the flex, but it starts spinning around, hit the flex. Oh, hit the flex! Kia! Yeah. Do, do you need help? <laughs> I've just died. I've only just died. <laughs> Less than five minutes into the stream. Because I know what you're like, you'll get frustrated very quickly. <laughs> I feel like I should be Yeah, and then block on it and then talk. Once your head goes up, you want to run towards a leg. Once the lightning starts, and it'll push you up. Once you spin, hit the flare. You, you can't you can't do the reflect spam when you're moving you've got to be standing still for it to, for it to proc right okay. essentially stand still reflect stand still and mash reflect 
and it'll bounce everything at you. If you're moving, it'll t it'll, the movement will take priority over the reflect. is that running um, stop thing so you can mark triangle. There is a way you can do that. Okay. is phrasing. <laughs> no, the correct response is I am to justify <laughs> what you can do. There I go. Ah, you have a triangle. Yeah. Ah. Hey, Zora, hit your triangle. Zora, it's that simple. You hit your triangle, but which one are you? Which one am I? I'm going start with S, so you can my triangle. And you're the brown lion coat. Yeah. yeah. This is the blood set. Yeah. 
What about that? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, God. Yeah. Uh, not right now, John. Oh, let's do a screenshot in a minute. Uh... <laughs> oh, thanks. Attack the fucking. I know how to attack that core, you. I'm trying to do that. Thanks, game. Game's like, oh, you do this thing. <laughs> hey, Simba, do something. I know, I know. Get chased by that that do something. There we go, see so you did something. Oh, I'll find the Told him to do something, you did. Turn your ass to me. Goddamn heartless. How about you? Yeah. No, I think you're playing on normal. Yeah. Yeah, I'll, I'll just get 
there's, there's no hiding. No. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, she, you know how to play on a level one, do you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Uh -huh. That's interesting. Uh, I will have a heart. It's the poor boy. Keep for your magic to recharge and then hit use if you've got thunder on your heart bar, use thunder. There is die. Because you've got to do a you've got to, you've got to do a, a finisher or a magic attack on the bosses to kill them in this game. They changed it so you can't just hit them once. No worries, dead. Okay. Good. Eventually. <laughs> very worried about the golden bus fight. You need reflect for that. Simba seems fine now. Why am I helping ah, the you? The king do has that? returned. Uh, His pride lands will not forget King Simba's I'm courage, or the courage of those who fought beside him. Do you think your quest will ever be over? I don't know. I can't remember. Is that my but I think Roderick? as long as the Keyblade stays with me, I don't know. I'll have to keep fighting. Yeah, the, yeah, ah, the guy who the struggle two people. never ends. That is the Wait, great what? circle of life. Hey, I look never like you up. Ever. The secret to victory oh, is a strong yet. heart. Go on, go on, go, go then! <laughs> go on, get out! Yes, yes, it is time! Your fight continues! Till we meet again, your majesty. I hope that's soon. It will be. So long. Pride lands done. Uh, when you get to the, when you get to a menu, would you check what your level is? Because I'm severely worried that we're going to be under level for the rest of the world. Oh, yeah, does need to do grinding? We can do grinding. Uh, I am. What well, says battle level foot? Forty-three. Wait, what's that? Oh, that's the wrong one. Wait. You want to be 55 to 60 years old, but I don't think we're going to be doing that much grinding. Um, ideally... What do we have to... Oh, we have to go to a place, don't we, to see them? Yeah, but I said ideally when you can get to a menu. Um, ideally, we would like to be 55 to 60 years old, because Zoldan is an absolute, can I swear? Of course, always. Am I allowed to speak? Fucking hell. He's an absolute in this game. Um, out of all the data old members, for a story boss, he's an absolute cunt. Well, even on the easiest difficulties, you can wipe away your health bar with his DM. Um, he's ridiculous. He's so, master. where are you? What? What? DM. Dungeon Master. No, DM. Creation moves. They do it after a certain, a certain amount of health, and when they, the lower the health gets, the more they spam those moves. Was there more stuff we can do to... I think we've done most well, of it. No. You, you can check whether there's anything left to do on the worlds uh, when you go close to them. And they, well, you see there, there's only one keyhole done. That means the sec you've got to do the second thing. The second thing is Zaldin. Yeah, but you just see where it says the name. Yeah, I can Two see pictures. that. Two pictures. Yeah. Right. That, that second, that second unlock, that second key there is the Zolden fight. Right. So that place we don't want to go to right now. No, not unless you want me doing this fight for you. Well, we got three at Hollow Bastion, or is that is that later? No, Hollow Bastion you can do now. It will chuck you back into the. You see anywhere that's got light around it? 
that's where you need to go for the story to go you know complete the the story so you've got three things there with light around them saying you you anywhere that you see like aladdin's world there's no light spinning around it yeah. because you've done that fun stuff there that you need to do so you see Ariel's world, there's a light there, it's wanting you to finish what's there. The light is basically telling you what you haven't finished. Oh, we should, do, we should go there then, because... Well, right, so you need certain abilities ah. to do each, each bit of the story. That's why you, we said leave it till last, because when you leave it till you unlock the world that never was, which is right in the background, it's about big shorty place, you'll have all the abilities to do Atlantis and Rumbo. You've got to go to Atlanta again, get an ability, come back, go, come back, go, come back. And Atlanta is absolutely completely skippable in this game as well. <laughs> yeah, but it's all good. So, where do you suggest I go? Uh, let's have a look what you've got left to do. Um, I would highly suggest Hollow Bastion, because that's got three to do. Cool, what have we got? Um, well, we've done one, but we've got two more to do. Yes, you've got two more to do, but the fifth one is a little bit awkward to do, and I think it's the Sephiroth thing, and you said you didn't know whether you were going to take that on, and if you were, you would probably have to get me to do it. So, the other the other keyhole is will be story-related. Okay, so, Hollow Bastion's no-go, then. I, no, Hollow Bastion you can do, you can only do one more keyhole though, because the third keyhole you need to fully complete the world is Sephiroth, but he's optional. You've got two keyholes to do, so one is Story, and the last one is Sephiroth, so you can do Hollow Bastion. Do I not have all the abilities for Atlantico? Because I've done quite a bit. No, it asks you to have the fully leveled up a version of some abilities to do that. You only get level the the fully levels of abilities by completing the second bit of every world. Right, okay. So let's get a hold of Bastion then. And I think one of them is Beast's Castle, so you do have to do that anyway to do with Landica. Right, where should I go? Where's best to go? Melon's house, post turning, Crystal Fist, yeah. Handsome's study. I presume, if I remember correctly, you want to go into Tron's world. Which is in Handsome's study? It's the one that has the weird red light thing. Yeah, Handsome's study. It's been a while since I've played this game. Hey, look, Squall. Hey, Squall. Hey, Squall. Squall's cool. So, you go up to the red light. Yeah. And it should have a triangle there. I can't remember if we've done everything to drop the Mark of Troy Tron again, but we'll see. Just gonna say. So I can't remember which world unlocks the next bit of Tron's thing. This device allows you to see Tron. Yeah, you do that and then you go to the computer and it should. Hello, computer. Allow you. Behind you. Yep. Iota. There you go. Yes. Woo. Time to go to the Digiverse. So you have, I do believe you have unlocked. This normally doesn't offer you that. Oh, uh, try going to the original holding cell phone, should be here. Uh, which is where? The first area. Try go. Try access the computer and then go to the first area. Uh, we can go back to the research lab or the light side, of course. Try your research lab? I mean, that's just gonna take us back out. No, no. Hold on. Yeah. Okay. 
you not touch the save in the um did you not use the save in the the holding cell? Uh, basically, to when you leave a world to get back into certain places of the world, you've got to have touched the save there to be able to travel in it. If you haven't touched the save, you have to manually walk your ass all the way back there. Alright, so I gotta walk my ass, let's go. I think you do, because as far as I know, um. So got a pit cell? Go. Oh. Hold on. Um. I'm getting confused now. It's been a while since I've been. Go on the main menu. And look up the story thing and tell and see what it said the last thing you did in this world was. The journal? I've... Yeah. It's been way too long since I played this game. I need to go back to it. Uh, story? Yes. There you go. Let's have a look. Scroll at the bottom, right. Scroll up. You want to see where it said... Scrolling up to where it, where it mentions Tron by any chance, because if it says that, um, if it mentions that Tron defeated the CPU, then I think might be wrong on having two store one more story thing for a lot. I thought there's something here because there's. Um. Yeah, it says the DTD that we say it says that we. have got the thing to the DTD, but um, go into the boss thing of all the bosses that you've fought so far and see if it's got the CPU. The collection. I swear we haven't fought. Um, character files. Character files. If you fought the boss in the CPU, when you click on Hollow Bastion, you should come up if you fought him. Gotta fight bosses for them to get to get their character input. Louis, Dibby, Louis. No, we haven't fought the CPU. It should be here. Right. At least I don't think we fought the CPU. Yeah, but this is character files, isn't it? So it's not... Yes, but um, the CPU is not a heartless or a nobody, so its boss entry would come in character files. To get Sephiroth's character file, you have to beat his boss fight. Okay. That's why I said, if it's not in the character file, then you haven't fought it. So, let's go. Yeah, I think you need to go back to the holding cell, and then go speak to Tron. The pit cell? It should be. Yeah, but you haven't got the, the save for you haven't got the thing for the holdings. Yes, pit sir. cell, yeah, there you go. Right. That's what I was asking for. I don't know why it didn't let you do it on the other one, it should let you do it from the end. Right. So it should be a pop here. Well, I'd never really explore. Oh, let me go. I can go back to where I was because this new area. We didn't, really, we didn't really explore it. We just went back out. Alright. So let's go to the new area Maybe. and then explore that little new area. Well, it could literally be that you just need to talk to something to get it the park. I can't remember. Polybash is not my favourite world in Kingdom Hearts 2 because it has so much shit you need to do. Hold on, um, I think I know what we need to do. Yes. Okay. Oh. Um, so we need to follow the 
I used to fly and get yes. along to us. Go down. Yes. I don't think we've done that because you should have a save point at the final destination to the boss. And we don't have that, which means we have not bought the boss. The boss is on that red door, but I did. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. To the simulation hangar. I can't write it without the solar sailor. Right, so we need a proper thing to get to the uh, need a proper one. Uh, so, uh, yeah, I can't remember what we haven't had that done. I have a funny feeling we need to fight Zorgan across the hollow basket ship, and I'm hoping we don't. No way. Okay. This is the only way. I'm gonna go this way and see what happens. Just explore. Worst comes to worst, just run to a few levels while I find out. Finally, that's good. Oh, Jesus fucking died. Yeah! Wait, turn the door over here. They don't have to be in the team anymore to level up, like they did in Kingdom Hearts 1. The experience is shared between all characters now. Which meant you just didn't really want to have the other characters, the additional characters in, because it's like, why would I want to level up a character that I can only use for one area? It's like, oh, I'll never use these characters because I want to have my levels for the characters I can use through the entire game.
What it says here, uh, we may have to go to Twilight Town because there may be a cutscene there that we need to unlock that will then um, trigger the Hollow Bastion one. Because okay. apparently Twilight Town should disappear and it'll reappear when we've done the second world visit of every world. Thank you. Once I finish beating up Gold, then. Why that power should become available again? I need to really go with the level one rule of this game. Yeah, just just get used to it again. The one time you're not calling me crazy. No. Uh, you think I'm a bit nuts for this? Ah, you love the games. It's fine. Uh, right, so that. So wait, just go to places with sparkles? Yes, essentially. Anywhere that has a sparkle on it, we might. I don't. We, well, we can't do Hollow Bastion because we can't unlock the thing yet. Okay. Something. We need to prop something for it to unlock. There should be a cutscene with Tron. Um, should well, be like he should be like on the floor and he's not there anywhere. So we haven't unlocked it yet. So I think it's Twilight Town. Twilight Town. Because obviously, because if it isn't Twilight Town, then it is Shaldin. <laughs> but from what I know, Twilight Town should disappear, and it's still there and we can still access it. So it hasn't disappeared yet. Now I've got a skateboard. Yay! Oh god damn it. Woohoo! Skateboards! Skateboard. Aw, oh, my skateboard. Boo. Ah, oh, the skateboard back. Yay! Whee! I got skateboards. Oh yeah, I'm doing some sick riding. There. What? Sorry, I got distracted by skateboards. Oh, there's a chest up there. Let me go. Yes. Just a I see a chest that I couldn't get to, so I might be able to get to that. Let me see if I can get to that. Okay, oh, hello. Oh, hello. Oh, no, wrong one. Oh, no, stop. Oh, no, stop. Oh, no. How many ice what they keep coming? What am I to do? Oh. Kill the bees! Ah. So I say kill the bees. They're not talking because we may not have done enough of the second world visits to prop the cutscene unlock. But we've done pretty much all of them. There may be one, I think you've yeah. got to do like so many, we haven't done like any of Atlantis, have we? Um, I don't know. Atlantica. Yeah. yeah. Let's, go, well, let's, let's go there then. It might be so. It literally might just be Zaldin. I say we get it. Because he's 
Because he's a data old boss, he is technically a story boss. So that means he's not optional. It may literally be, I'm just looking at the list of bosses that we need to proc cutscenes. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try Atlantica first, because that one's one that's like we haven't touched and I want to touch it. Uh, just be forewarned that if you don't have all the abilities to max, you may get stuck for a little bit. Ah, that's fine. I can always leave. I just want to. I, I want to see that world because I haven't seen it yet. Especially since we haven't gone there. So uh, skateboards. Zaldin. What? We've got to do Zaldin, and then we've got to do Hercules, because the, the Hercules' world is currently greened out. We've got to do Zaldin to unlock the second visit to Hercules' world to proc the next story event. We have to fight Zaldin. There, but I'm saying to progress the story, which we can do, we have to fight Zaldin. Okay, well, I'm gonna go to Atlantica because I want to be there. Okay. Mostly because I just want to see that world. Because we've literally got no playtime there, so I'm like, let's, let's, let's go there. Well, you should enjoy it because it's, rhythm, it's a rhythm mini game singing thing in Atlantica this time. Yes! All of it. The entire world is singing minigame. Oh, the night sky is so beautiful right after a storm. <sighs> really? You've got another <sighs> skateboard, really? What? Huh? I'm watching I'm watching the thing on stream and all I see is you want a skateboard. Skateboards! What would I give? <laughs> You know what, for Christmas, I'm not getting you an Xbox One, what I'm just going to get you a skateboard. No, to please stay don't, I have no balance. Beside you. What would I do to see you smiling at me? Oh, this is going to be copyright Where strike. would we walk? Where would we run? If we could stay all day in the sun. Hope he stops when I put this on YouTube just and just goes, Ah, this bit is muted. And I could be <sighs> part of your world. I don't know. I've seen several people put the songs from this up, and they haven't got copyright strikes, so... Some I do, some are fine. Sometimes they go through fine, and sometimes Disney goes, hang on a minute, no. And then I go, it's game, it's fine, and then they go, Disney still go, no. So I go, okay, well, I'm muting that section then, so... What was it? girl rescued me. Um, her voice. Her voice. Her weird fishy tail. Don't say that while everyone's listening. Atlantica! Uh, I tell you now, the boss fight is rhythm game based as well. Yes! <laughs> Finally, the one I'm good at. Oh boy, I didn't Whoa. see it, boy! Oh, I think it was like. Either earlier this year or last year, where I went through and just watched Sir, all the little mermaid films. Donald, Goofy. I watched like one, two, three, oh, and then the remake. Hi there. Hello. Forget how to swim already. Kind of. I, I think it was. Well, my mum said she hadn't ever seen Little Mermaid. It's like, why you haven't seen Little Mermaid? Got to practice. You follow Flounder. He show you what to do. Come on, Sora. You can do it. I actually don't mind the have you, decided, have you decided what you want for dinner tomorrow? Uh, no. I need to order it because I'm eventually. That's 
true. Uh, yeah, I'll have a look because I've done a put Yeah, get the Lexi special. what that is again. Uh, it's not like Papa John's you normally order the... Ah, oh, it's the custom pizza I make for you. Well, I was going to say, I'm pretty much going to order Massimo's tomorrow for dinner, but that's just because it makes me feel happy and I need a uh, serotonin boost in gives me one. Because mm -hmm. it's anniversary, what I want that day. You forgot how to swim? What have you been doing all this time? What? You're asleep? That must be a... That must have been some nap. Yes. Come on, let's find Flounder. It's right there. Yes, that's it. You're a quick learner, Sora. Okay. Okay, thanks, game. That's much better. Now then. What brings you to... What do you brings you three into DC? Is something going on? So kind of. do the Sebastian Spillar. Uh but everything seems uh, peaceful. Do oh. the boys. A minute. Oh everything's fine. As long as Daddy's in a good mood. Oh god. <laughs> no. Hey, hey, oh. we got a concert very oh. soon. Why don't you sing in a musical extra e extravaganza? Please say yes. Ariel's been acting strange lately. But she might settle down and practice if you dare here too. That sounds fun. Let's give it a shot. Excellent. Now then, I teach you everything you need. Uh, what do we need? What do we have to do? It's easy. Musical challenge. Press X in time with the song and gauge. Oh God, I hope it's not like. I hope it's not like the ice cream minigame. It's not. All it's, you gotta uh... do is feel the rhythm. Hit the beat and put a little shake in it. Ready? Let's go. That diamond's a little off, but you almost got it. Okay, Donald, your turn. You do just like Sora. Then he what? Then he see what you got. Okay. Okay. Enjoy. Then, huh. Okay. At least that's a little bit more clearer with the timing than it is than the ice cream one. That's it. Goofy, it's you now. You think you could do better? Cool. So, do you not by bringing up that mini game? What? Don't traumatize me by bringing up that mini game. Well, uh, it's relatable because it's Kingdom Hearts and this is Kingdom Hearts, and this this one's better. This time you gotta oh, dance okay. with Ariel. Remember, don't miss the beat. Because I'll have to do that mini game at least once when I uh, stream. Well, you're still gonna do it another two times technically with me. So you're that's not it. Yet. Now we jamming with the bubbles. The rules is to get same. You gotta stick to the beat. Now we're playing with bubbles. That's right. You got it. That's all there is to it. Gosh, I don't know. Anytime you want to sing in a music bus piece, you just come see me. Under the sea, kingdom map. Okay. It looks like it's Sebastian. Okay. It's because it is so tiny, it's one room in this thing. Remember, fill the room with your body. Uh, sure, take part in the music school. Yeah, I'll give it a go. Chapter way, swim this way. I'm just, I'm just gonna plug in the arcade stick, cause...
timing would be better on that thing. It doesn't have any button mashing in this game, as far as I know. In this one, as far as I know. Yeah, but it's still a wired controller, which is going to be better than a uh, wireless one. But this one is not nearly as bad. It doesn't have anything like you've got to move it. It's you just press X. And occasion occasionally, yeah, sometimes. Uh, there we go. Break a fin. Here goes nothing. Uh, right. Let the music move you. You can do it. Don't be shy. Let the music inside you dance, dance, dance. See, you can do it. Swing this way, we'll dance, dance and we'll play. Now it's very easy. Come on in, just take a chance and shake a fin. Watch the stage now. How exciting! See the sign. Can you reach it in time? Oh, tap, tap, tap. Don't worry, you'll get the next one. And if you can't reach the target, use magic! It's all the same if you want steady aim. Press up, zap, zap. There, you got the rhythm now! Swim this way, we'll dance and we'll play. Now it's very easy, come on in, just take a chance to shake a fin. Now what about the bubbles? What about just the bubbles? Just a touch, cause it won't take too much to pop, pop, pop. <laughs> on to the next one! Swim this way, we'll dance and we'll play. Now it's very easy, come on in, just take a chance to shake a fin. From Solo, here's the sign, give him the cue! Count him in so he'll know to begin to drum, drum, drum. Now the cues are up to you! Here's your big moment, make them cheer! Don't dilly dally, it's your big finale, sha la la! You made quite a splash! That was fantastic! Swim this way, we're dead, swim, we're playing, now it's very easy, come on, and just take a chance to shake a fin! Swim along, just join in the song, a musical for everyone to have a lot of finny fun! Sorry, a little finny fun. Saying nothing. This is from what we get up to. I'm saying Sora, nothing. Sora, you are amazing. I am amazing. Hi, I want to sing more loud. No one wants to hear your singing voice, Donald. We Your Benny Majesty, happy? we have visitors. King Triton. Oh, God. I certainly hope there hasn't been a need to use that keyblade of yours. No, nope. everything's fine. Not, not a heartless in sight. Has different implications. Your Majesty, our guests, they want to sing in the musical. Well, that sounds like a splendid idea. We may need but your help after all. Sure. You see, I'm afraid Ariel's still infatuated with the human world. A busy rehearsal so schedule kind of might be just the thing she time. needs to stop thinking about life up on the surface. Yeah. Okay, you see that moustache coming towards you? You forget that moustache. It's, it's a magic, a magical moustache. Swim along, just join in huh? the song. A musical for Worry. everyone to have a lot of finny fun. That's the voice I heard. I'm sure of it. Hello? Where are you hiding? Oh, I forget he's voice. I know you're the girl who saved me. Oh, at least Please, in, in, uh, come in the out so I can thank you. Person is, um, 90s Spider Man. I think. Oh no, you're nerd. This is all. Ariel? 
Well, it stuck out like a sore thumb when I was watching the movie. I was just that like, that's Spider-Man's voice. Again. Probably been flitting around on the surface. Oh, the Sea King's gonna have my class for this. Come on, we gotta keep rehearsing. I need to be, get Spider-Man 2, actually. I'm sorry, but I don't feel like it. Um, tomorrow... Mm-hmm. No, Ariel! I've got an idea, Sebastian. I'll get it, I'll plant the load and I'll give it to you. I know how to cheer Ariel up. Come on, follow me! Okay. I mean, and yeah. The... also have to order theatre risen for you as well. Yeah, it's probably best to get it on eBay because uh, Dead Souls is already on. It's only, you're only going to be able to get it at uh, second hand. Over here! That's fine. Like I said, just think which what you want to do to win that game. And just want, but you'll have to remind me to do it in the morning. Oh no, this must be from the human world. I found it after the storm. I bet it's from a sip, ship, a shipwreck, a shipwreck. Oh, don't, you're very good at that word. <laughs> don't you think Ariel's gonna love it? But if the if the Sea King sees that, if the Sea King finds out about this, it's better than going to the surface. Come on, help me move it. It's no use. You need mag magnet magic to move the statue. A new episode has been added. I'll put you out, and then you gotta go in like several times each time. That's dumb. We've already got the magic spell. It shouldn't. It shouldn't make you do that. Uh. Oh, Fluffs are having an argument. You don't have to manually cast the spell, you just have to have learned it. Yeah, I've got Magna River over. So I'm good. So I just... okay, if it wants Magna Ra, it'll say Magna Ra. If it's saying Magnet, it won't. It just wants the basic Magnet. It'll tell you exactly which level of spell you need. What's this? You can move the statue now? This is gonna cause me more problems. Uh, I assume I just go to the wall with the music. Okay. Talk to Flounder. Do I talk to Flounder? Yes, because you need to. You ready to move the statue? Thing. Let's move it. The Chapter two. Part of your world. Group. Part of what your music world. world. That's there. Is if you want to replay songs. That's uh, all I get you. Generally, every time it kicks you out, go and talk to Flounder, and it should if you've got the spell. We'd like you to come with us, Ariel. Have we got something to show you? <gasps> it's a pretty cool statue, huh? It looks like some kind of prince. Prince? Prince Eric? Nope. I think it's a Prince Eric. Yeah, Little Mermaid. Who is... Yeah. Who's he played? Does he play Playman King? Yeah, he does Playman King Hearts 2. Yeah, Spider-Man. Yeah. What? I can't help it. I love me as a Spider-Man. Control your nerdiness. You're Look at this stuff. Isn't it neat? I'm nerdy about Spider-Man. Wouldn't you think my collection's complete? 
Wouldn't you think I'm the girl, the girl who has everything? Look at this trove, treasures untold. How many wonders can one cavern hold? Looking around, here you think, sure, she's got everything. I've got gadgets and gizmos aplenty. I've got who's it's and what's it's galore. You want thing in the box? I got 20. But who cares? No big deal. I want more. I want to be where the people are. I want to see. want to see them dancing, walking around on those. What do you call them? Oh, feet. Up where they walk. Up where they run. Up where they stay all day in the sun. What? You got their trunk as well. Well done. Like one way. Is that part of the world? I know it. I don't know what I'm singing. Ariel, part of that world. We're here to help you, you their know. Their world. Oh no, you three stay out of it! Look who's talking. I've it. Yeah, you are gonna tell your dad about it. What am I going to do? Oh no. Oh no, me. Oh no. His dad's gonna be mad. Daddy's gonna be mad. I'm literally sick. You're late, Sebastian. Is something wrong? No, nothing, Your Majesty. That's good. So tell me, how is the song for the musical coming? It is finished, Your Majesty. It celebrates all the wonderful things found here in the ocean. It'll be my finest work. Will it get Ariel's mind off the human world? Uh, yes, well, probably, possibly. I mean, most definitely. Excuse me, Your Majesty, but I must rehearse. You understand. This is terrible. We've got to do something. She can't be in the musical like that. I'll sing her part instead. Shut up, Donald. No way, not a chance. <laughs> what? Why not? Hey, it's Sebastian. Yeah, I can't, I can't do a Donald voice. It's a really hard voice. Hold on. This will never work. What's up? I've composed a perfect song for the musical. But I think it's going to be too complicated for you. Oh, come on. How hard can it be? I wish I could read. Uh oh. To participate in the musical, you need the drive gauge to be S or more. A new episode it's has been not unlocked. S, it's... What? It doesn't want your drive gauge to say S, it wants you to have a drive gauge of 5 or more. Well, I wish I could read. That looks like an S rather than a 5, but okay. Because it goes up one level for every, um, every time you do a certain amount of story, the drive gauge goes up by one. Lately, Ariel just stares at the statue and sighs. I wish there was some way we could make her smile. Okay, up to you. Uh, hey, Ariel. You see my drive you gauge? What? You, just... what? you realise what you just said, right? No. The statue, she's staring at the statue and the size and you want her to smile. Yeah. Your brain's not coming in yet. Nope. The surface is so near, yet so far. Oh, if only I could convince Daddy how wonderful humans are. Oh, God. What? She's just 
Talk about da daddy. Oh yeah, Sebastian. Is it you all ready to talk to? <laughs> I'm just talking to daddy. Hello daddy. Excellent! We'll be able to perform the musical with ease. Let's do it! Chapter 3. Under the Sea. Ah, if only I'd heard of that song before. That's a new one. The seaweed is always greener oh, in somebody awesome. else's lake. You dream about going up there. Oh, fuck. That is a bit oh, wow. mistake. Just look at the world around you, right here on the ocean floor. Such wonderful things around you. What more is you looking for? Under, Under the, the sea. Under the, the sea. Darling, it's better down yeah, where it's wetter. Take it from me. Up on the shore, they work all day. Out in the sun, they slave away. While we devoted full time, they floated under the sea. Stop. Under the sea. Under the sea. Since life is sweet, here we got the beat and naturally. Oh. I'm so Even the, the sturgeon and the rain. They get the urges you are, there is We got the spirit, you got to hear it under the sea. You want to press it with good range, because sometimes you get an excellent. So you're aiming to the sea. Under the sea. Under the sea. Under the sea. Each little snail here know how to whale well here. That's why it's hotter. Under the water. Yeah, we in luck here down in the muck here. Under the sea. Failed. Right, let's try that again. You gotta do better. Okay, I will. Uh, where's? Oh, I've got to talk to Sebastian. Right. Go oh, back. Let's do it. Skip the intro. No, oh, skip the intro. The seaweed is always greener in somebody else's lake. You dream about going up there, but that is a big mistake. Just look at the world around you, right here on the ocean floor. Such wonderful things around you. What more is you looking for? Under, under the, the sea, under the sea. sea. Darling, it's, it's better down where it's wetter. Take it from me. Up on the shore, they work all day. Out under in the, the sun, they slave away. away. While under we the devoted sea. full time, they floated under the sea. I can't learn from love. Under the sea. Under the sea. Since life is sweet here, we got the beat here naturally. Even the sturgeon and the rain, they get the urges not to play. We got the spirit, you got to hear it under the sea. Under the sea, under the sea, under the sea. We got a hot crustacean man Each little clam here know how to jelly under, under the sea Each little slug here caught no rug here under the sea <laughs> Each little snail here know how to whale here That's why it's hotter under the water Yeah, 
I think I've got a Oh, I think it's a great music. song, Sebastian. It's just, it's not I what I want to sing. Uh, oh. and that's why he's chewing the take back. I want to sing about it is how hard to sing, but also can live in harmony, so. land and sea together. Under the, the sea, sea king would make chowder out of me if you sang a Darling, song like it's that. better down where it's wetter under the sea. If you won't listen, then I'm not going to sing at all. You got it right one time. Well, yeah, Ariel. Because I'm not on the buttons. How do I get no, myself into this situation? Man, not only oh. has that girl fallen in love at the worst possible time, but with a human! Ariel's in love oh, with no. a human? <gasps> that is mad. Oh, me and my big mouth! That means it's completely something else to me. Oh, no. Looks like his daddy is very mad. Oh! Right, you have to excuse me for a minute, I'm going to put a fluff dinner on, so if you hear my air fryer go on and you hear a ping later on, you're aware of what's going on, because I need the dinner and bring me to the evening meds. That's fine, I'll, I'll do the story and then I'll probably take a, a break on stream. No worries, let's just get the air fryer going on. Yeah, that's fine. Is that him? Uh-huh. Let's say something. No, don't! He's a human, I'm a mermaid, I don't know what he'd think. He just poops sparkles. What's that? What did he just poop out of his butt? Oh, it must be his... But we can't reach it. Rats. You need Magnera -na 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 to do that. A new episode, it was added. Yep, I gotta, okay. I'll take a quick break and I'll be right back. There we go. Right, what am I talking to now? Sora looks like you gained some experience. Do you think you can help me with the pendant? Let's get it! Chapter 4 Ursula's Revenge This is great, Sora. I know he'll be happy to have this back. And just who is this he? Ariel, you know how dangerous humans are. You don't even know him! Oh, Daddy, you've told me that you don't trust humans, but they can't all be as bad as you say. And I'm... well, I'm gonna prove it to you. So help me, Ariel. I, I am to going to get through to you. And, and if this is the only way... Prepped, um, so And there goes the air fryer, so I'm just gonna let it cool down. Spoil little fluffers. <laughs> Ariel, you poor child. You're Ursula, the sea witch. Didn't my father banish you? That's right, angelfish. She really what? She really forgotten the events of the first game? I, it's confusing, because they're basically just doing the, the same... They're basically doing the Little Mermaid again. And it's like... 
because some people may have skipped the world in the first game because you can get away with skipping Atlantis if you do Hercules so some people may not have done the story of the first world so they've done this just in case you didn't do that but if you did do all the worlds then this does not make sense no it, it's weird but how could I stay away when I knew you were so miserable what you need is a woman's advice oh no what if I can make all your dreams come true? My father would never allow it. Oh, well, it must be love if you, you'll you give up that easily. C could you really help me? But how? Well, the only way to get what you want is to become human yourself. A human? How could you do that? My dear sweet child, that's what I do. This is terrible, Flounder. You gotta tell the king. Okay. Have we got a deal? I'll turn you into a human right now. All you have to do is sign a little contract. A contract? That's right, sweet cakes. And the price is just a token. A trifle. Oh, you want a trifle? Oh. What I want from you is your voice. My voice? I almost forgot the magic only lasts for three days. You, uh, you've got to get your dear old princey to kiss you. Before the sun sets on the third day. If he doesn't, you turn into a mermaid and belong to me. I suppose you might find my terms a little tough. After all, you are King Triton's daughter. Adored by all of Atlantica. Why, you're practically guaranteed a happy life. Are you sure you won't listen to your daddy? All it'll cost you is your true love. Come on, sweetie pie. This is your last chance. But far, uh, but far be it from a little uh, old me to twist your arm. Don't listen to her, Ariel. Well, now, I won't intrude any longer. I'll be on my way. You obviously don't want my help. Too bad about your prince, though. He is quite a catch. Wait! All I have to do is sign? Sir, your sound is cut off on your side. We have what? a deal. Here you go. Ariel, don't! Sora, please! You got to stop her! Oh, mind. there you are. I was going to say, Wait. the sound cut off on your side and it just went quiet for a couple of minutes. Oh. I was like, what happened? What's the cutscene? Yeah, okay, no, it's just because I only talk over the characters when there's no actual line. Stuff when it's when the stuff voice take it out. Oh, and now she's a now she's got legs. Oh no! She can't breathe like that! Oh no, she forgot she can't breathe underwater. But to be fair, Ursula uh, did say she was turning uh, into a human right now and Ariel didn't think that uh, right now might mean, hold on a minute, I'm under the water, I think twice. Hey, it's Spider Man. <sighs> God damn it. I'm never gonna not think it's Spider Man. Are you the girl? Please wake up. But this game what has. This game has uh, Leonard Nimoy in it, right? Or is it another game? Uh, no, that's that's Birth by Sleep. Whoa! Ah, uh, I don't have to play Birth by Sleep if it's got if it's got Spock himself. 
He's um he plays old man Zayno in uh I think You can't speak? Birth by sleep. And oh. where did you come from? D D D. Uh, and after that Kingdom Hearts three obviously they got a new voice actor in because he did pass away mm -hmm. before do that so uh, I think he, he, Zeno only appears in BBS and That's DDD my pendant. Um, in the old man form I, I can't believe you uh, found unless it. you're doing Kingdom Hearts 3 but as far as I know he only appears in those two games so thank you yeah well I will be done please you, and, well, come with me I want to help you in BBS and he does voice in Kingdom Hearts 3 And yes, they did uh, pit them against each other. So Nimoy is the bad guy, and Hamill is the good guy, because the people that were doing the game wanted a Star Wars versus, versus Star Trek thing going on in the story. So they figured they would do that. I mean, I thought Mr. Star Trek's better, but anyway. Uh, looks like it's going well. Gosh, shouldn't we tell King Troy about this? Absolutely not. It would break his heart if he found out about this. Ooh, well, you just get pissed off. Then what do we do? We gotta stay right here and take care of Ariel. That's what we gotta do. I guess that's what all we can do. Oh god. Nah. That's my talk. I should go check on Ariel. Let's go. We just float here and watch? Kinda creepy. Have you got a better idea? We could make Ursula fix all this. Huh. She ain't gonna bother with you. Hey, you never know until we try. Hmm, you might be right. It's gonna be better than nothing. Can I trust you? Uh, can I trust you to take care of Ursula? Of course, I took care of her last time. Also, I like how nobody questions how Ursula is back when she was killed in the first game. Uh, somehow Ursula returned. No, I, I know how she comes back, but I don't know if we've done the... Oh, we did do the... Did we do the... Hold on. We did do the first part of uh, Halloween Town, didn't we? So this isn't spoilers. Um, Maleficent br brings them all back. <sighs> she brought Oogie Boogie back, because we saw that. Hey, where's well, I like how um, if you're playing this before you do that, uh, well, that people don't question how she's back. The palace. Mm -hmm. I wonder if it's about Ariel. If King Triton finds out what happened, we're in hot water. Especially since we kept it a secret. What about Ursula? Like, oh, I'll have another boss fight with the same characters again. Well, how's Ariel doing? She's only got until sunset tomorrow, right? Hey, look! Oh. I can't see! Whoa! I don't think we're getting this game done They're tonight. They're okay! Man, they were so close. Well, I think we ought to get back to looking for Ursula. Yeah, good idea. <sighs> no sign of Ursula anywhere. I wonder where that sea witch could have gone. Ariel's been crying for a long time. Oh no. What would I give to live where oh, you are? Oh, having an argument. What would I pay to stay here beside you? What would I do to see you smiling at me? Where would we any walk? Video of them. Where mm -hmm. would we run if we could yeah, stay? I haven't got a video of them eating a prawn one ton yet. Ah, okay. With the prince. And uh, apparently they've just had a bitch slap fight over it.
Okay. You're stealing me, and I could be. It's Ursula. She, she must have turned herself into that girl. Okay, that's it. That's it. I'm smacking that woman. This <laughs> is <laughs> sorry, because that's it. Fucking Keyblade. To be fair, <laughs> you know what's coming here. Uh, boss fight. What? What happened? It sounds about right when you say I'm gonna smack this woman. I mean, <laughs> give me a dirty mind. Eric. You're not denying it. You... You can talk. Well... You're the one. The girl who sang to me. Oh, Eric. I wanted to tell you. You can tell of I'm course. interested. It mm -hmm. was you. You're the one who, mm -hmm. who saved me that night in the storm. Patience. Oh, Ariel. You I'm sorry I didn't I figure it out sooner. That. I really You're don't. the one I love. Eric. You're my patient, so Not be so patient. Fast. <gasps> Do you see what I see? <laughs> You're too late. No! Oh, God, the way Ursula just like Ariel coming at you. Stop. Oh, that reminds me. I need Stay to out of this, you fools! This Triton's precious little daughter signed uh, the contract. Now, dear, me let's a... see how beautiful you are yeah, when I'm through well. with um, you. You set up a reminder for that when I get up in the morning. No you good. know when you call me Let in the morning? Because obviously I've got my hospital appointment at a quarter past eight. Um, soon as you, I don't know what like time you're leaving tomorrow, but um, you when do. you're up in the morning. When you're up in the morning, would you send me a text just to remind me to make sure that I picked up your parcel? Because otherwise I'll go out, I'll go to the hospital, and then when I'm on my way back, I'm going past the post office, I forget to send the care package. Okay, so tell you about parcel on, on my way. Yeah, essentially, just because I don't, I, like I said, I've got, I'm leaving here at quarter to eight. Okay. So... Because otherwise I'll have to go and pick up the parcel and then get back on the metro and then go back to the post office and then go and send it. Yeah, yeah. Go! Excuse me! When there's actually a metro on the... Yeah, yeah. There's yeah, a we... post office on the, the metro station. So. Yeah, yes, that's fine. Oh, now Triton wants to smack a bitch. Now, now. Even the great King Triton can't go round breaking binding contracts. Why, it just wouldn't do, would it? Now, if you'll excuse me, I have some loose ends to tie up. Uh, my, Wait, Ursula. You Sunday. win. Just promise you'll let my daughter go. But, like, in, in but we miss a deal. Unless, of course, oh, you're okay. offering to take her place. I'm afraid uh, I have no choice. It is, it, it's based on Ursula, weirdly. <laughs> Majesty! You sure you're gonna have the energy to do that after Saturday? <laughs> yeah, I just gotta I just gotta go to basically kinda work. <laughs> no, it's just, just during the during the day, I'll start the evening with you. Well, I was thinking more about if you've got a long journey on a Saturday, you're gonna be tired when you get home and then you've gotta go and do that. Yeah, but it's it's, it's like a one o'clock, so it's like yeah, I'll have a lot of time. Oh, so it's not gonna be it's not gonna be like early, too At early. Yeah. No, it's gonna have plenty of time. Daddy! Yeah. It's about next, so Who's be... the mighty ruler of the seas oh, now? I just didn't want you, you not getting any you sleep because you've got long travel on go. Saturday. So ah. it's gonna be pretty much like what, ten o'clock before both of us get home? How dare you! Probably. Pitiful, insignificant human! Oh, we're both gonna hit the hay. Hey, fast. that's enough. Yeah. Ha ha! No, you won't so bow to me. me. <laughs> Sir, I don't expect you to. Okay. Apart from to tell me that you got home safely. Yeah. Because uh, that's not an optional call. I was gonna say I'll send you, send you a link to it. 
I'll show you the show. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> right. Uh, musical challenge. Okay. Oh, there's a rapid one. Sweet. Turbo mode. I think this is the only song that has that. Well, good thing I've got turbo mode. Uh, I don't know if that works on this song. I've never seen anybody do this song. Oh, it fucking does. Oh, I need to. I gotta need to be. Ca okay, let me retry really because I, I need to be a bit careful with the other ones that aren't. Uh, <laughs> it works. I'm waiting to see this one. I'm waiting for the catch up on the thing. I want to see this. And I get an evil laugh like that out of you. It's it's there gonna be a good time. Oh yeah, just restart so you'll see it again. And get some. Please, when I play this game, can I just let you play the Atlantic section and you and I can do what you do with it? Hilarious. Yeah. I don't think so. <laughs> oh, I missed that one. That's fine. I don't think you lose this boss fight, you've already killed her. <laughs> She's already dead! <laughs> Alright! Quick! Where the hell is the zombie? What a feeble human, no, I can't move my I don't think they bombed for this! Really not! Without your precious mermaid, you're this for me when I can I do my game. I need this in my life. So. I'm not gonna lose her! You get to do this twice, you have to attack in the game twice, by the way, so. This should be a fun, good laugh. Oh yeah, it's yeah. yeah. The one we think, if they did know about this, they'd learn, because they didn't do this in Kingdom Hearts first by sleep, so they've obviously learned something. Sorry, Mommy. Your poopsies are toast. Say sorry, Mommy. I, yeah, I think Sora saying sorry, sorry mummy, because she be killed her pets, and it's she was calling for them to it. Clear! Oh, I yeah, got that one. <sighs> That's what you think! I don't know why you keep doing it, you already won! <laughs> It's she's flailing, possible. that's what she's doing. She's a magic cop, she's flailing. Mm -hmm. That belongs to me! Alright then. You can have it! <laughs> oh, so good. Oh, you know what you need to do? You need to clip that, right? And that would make a great shot, because you wanted a... Uh, Wanted ideas for short. Do that and just flame it. Turbo beats Ursula. I'd watch that shit over Please, and over. Area. You can come out now. It's okay. Ariel? <gasps> oh no, she's drowning herself. Oh, well, that was because I wasn't sure if uh, Turbo was going to work on this game because some games it doesn't work, so... It's like, a, Square Enix is pretty well known for some of the games like not letting Turbo be used, but... You see, but Eric? Apparently not smart enough on this game. This is I went to Ursula. <gasps> this can't be! I would have told you sooner. To think. Eric, goodbye. Bye, Eric. I had all that time and I didn't work on my swimming. Well, I guess it's never too late to learn, right? Will you teach me? Oh, I'd love to. All right!
Yay! I got a key blade. Prince Eric's a great guy, and he's really brave too. Yes, but he is a human. Oh, brother, not again. <laughs> Sebastian, you and your racism. <laughs> I mean, it, yeah. <laughs> Sebastian, the racist. Is it class as fishism? Because technically Sebastian's a fish. How'd it go with your father, Ariel? Great, thanks for your help. I gotta go. I'll see you later. You just got here. Hey, wait! I almost forgot, Sebastian. King Triton said this year's festival is so important that the musical better be your best ever. My best ever? All oh, right, what's going on? You gotta do me a favor. What? Huh? But how? And it was gonna make the song perfect too. You need thunder magic to carry out Sebastian's idea. I don't think you've got that. I think you've got Sundara. A, a, a new episode was, was added. Alright, where is Sebastian? You're racist. <laughs> racist. <laughs> he's, he's racist. He's, he's vicious. No, he's racist against humans. Looks oh, like you can handle this now. Now our musical will be perfect. I'm ready. <laughs> Chapter 5. A new day is dawning. Aim for 3,000 points or higher. Come together, join in peace and harmony. Fairy tales and miracles. Oh, I got this. This is the first place to get caught for That's just for me just mashing it myself. Oh dear. Well, it's easy to mash it. Easy to mash on an arcade stick. Like, 
Yeah, I've been. Oh, I'm gonna steal that hole. You definitely need to clip that air. Uh, that air. Um, <laughs> that three <laughs> Because I, no, I didn't know that that was a thing. Yeah, well, it said bashing, I was like, oh, hello. Yeah, but I just, I've never seen anybody that does Kingdom Hearts 2 without saying <laughs> I didn't know that was a thing. <laughs> That's because they got fighting game players to come up. They, <laughs> the fighting game players bring their arcade sticks. Sora, <laughs> what's happening? <laughs> An RPG. A new pathway has opened. What? You're gonna go? Uh... You this kind of just goodbye. like ruined. Yeah, I can't take this thing seriously now I know about that. Let's Ursula's been defeated. One, two, oh, we've still got to go on with like the, 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 the rest of the song. Give <laughs> five seconds. Oh, God. Well, then we're going to play the rest of the song. <laughs> Ursula's just crying as she's still singing the song. <laughs> I'm totally dead. <laughs> It really should just. It, it shouldn't let you do that. It really shouldn't, but it does. <laughs> Blizzard element. Ocarillacum. Plus. Oricalcum. <laughs> Doesn't sound any better when you said it. <laughs> Oricalcum. <laughs> Put the arcade stick now, though. Oh, that makes me sad. <laughs> well, there's no more songs, so... You can replay the songs. There is a thing for the records that makes you replay them if you want to complete the records. Sure. But, but... That's funny if you want to do that. That's fine. I'm going to play it two more times for you, so... Oh, I, I don't see that bit. I see that bit where it's <laughs> Because you're just going to be like, I need to do this world now. Brrrr. Alright. Done. When do I ever call you that? Yeah, that's true. Um. Uh, right. So By the way. Sir? Yeah? Anything that uh, has a shining thingy on it? Yeah. That shiny light generally means a story. But again... Most of the worlds have got the shiny thing on them, but the, you see the you see the thing going around the world. Yeah, that right. means just something there, but we can't access it yet. So I think we're going to have to do. We're gonna we're going to have to do is all We we can't get to Hercules, and we need to undo. We need to do Hercules before the next story thing will pop. So we have to do is all Right. So hello, Bastion. What? No, Zaldan is in Beast's Castle. Oh, Beast's Castle. Okay. I don't see this going so well. Oh, Beast's Castle. Land. Land ho. I'm gonna save, because I haven't saved in a while. What I will say is, you know the bridge? The bridge that leads out of Beast's Castle? Yeah. Stay away from there until... Obviously, Zaldan will run away. Do not chase him, because you need to know how to fight him. And if you go onto that bridge, you will pop that fight. And I tell you now, there is a certain way of fighting him, you can't just smack him. There is a certain way of doing a ton of damage to him without pocking his uh, revenge counter. Alright, so where am I going? You're going to go talk to Belle. Oh. Uh, hopefully she is this... Wait, is that... No, that's, that's where I came in it. No. Oh. Go up the stairs and you go to the... I think it's... To the right... <laughs> Oh, 
put that little bit delay on this thing. Uh, um, a nice, a funny way to deal with those, um, you know, those fancy wall uh, spike enemies is to cast match on them and it'll, it'll launch them up into the air and then you can just hit them. Okay, okay. You sing, you sing I think you've got right to get to battle. I can't remember. No, no, I don't. Right. Could be left, I can't remember exactly where Bell Water is. I'll know when you go onto the next screen and I can see the layout, doesn't it? I can't remember. Yes, I can. Let's go right. We'll try right next. To the West Wing! See you smashing those night things. The only thing you're collecting from those night things is drive gauge, and your drive gauge is apparently full right now. Why are you smashing them? Because I like smashing things. I don't know if it's worth on every one of the possessed statues, but if you hit the possessed statues with thunder, sometimes it'll have come up with a reaction command called release, which will release the heartlessness possessing the statue out of the statue, and you can essentially kill it pretty quickly. But it already works, sometimes it doesn't work all of the time. Oh, if you don't want to fight the statues and they're annoying you, you can do that, but it does, like I said, doesn't work all of the time, it works some of the time. Ah, okay. But you can do that, I know it does work. I'm afraid Bell isn't here. Judging by our clothes, I doubt she went outside. Why don't you try the master's room? So now, when you go to Beast's room, Bell should be there, because if you go there before talking to the wardrobe, she won't, it won't do it, you've got to talk to the wardrobe to get that to happen. So now you go back, and there's a cheap way to do this. Um, access the save point in the room, teleport out, teleport, you know, back to the room that you came in, and then just run to Beast's side, and you cut off about two minutes of having to run all the way back. No, I mean like later on when you've got to, you know, run back and forwards all the time, that is a trick you can do. Because okay. you'll be running back and forwards sometimes, so if you, if you need to do that, just world, like, world map it and then teleport in. It's so much easier. <laughs> Believe it or not, that trick works in King of Hearts 1 as well. I wasn't thinking about that. Okay. Uh, wait. This is yeah. If you go up and then to the left, you should 
access to the area which could be the beast in there. Uh, to the west wing. The other way. Back. Yeah, because the other way, if you go right, goes back into the um, thing where you had to get cogs with to handle out the hang on that stupid handle to unlock the door. I don't want to say we're going to do Stardew Valley, there's the optimism arrives, but it doesn't leave me enough time to set the save. That's a long, lot of quests. No, no, because no, I said I was going to play it with myself. Yeah. Yes, but I've got to set the save so that when you're done playing it, mine is ready to go. Oh yeah, but there's going to be a bit of fun. It's going to take me a long time to do that, because I'm going to play through how many games? I'm going to do every side quest of every game, yeah. so the point is I need to know how long I've got to do it. Beast Room! Ah, there, there we go. Two red... Cutscene now. Birth by Stupid Day. Yay! Beast is mad. What's wrong? Please, calm down! Calm down? At least he has a world in this game. <clears throat> you like, just had to have a party, didn't you? Don't you see what's happened? Hey, what's with you? The rose. My rose. What? That? He took it? But surely you can find another rose. Silence! You don't know anything! That's not fair, beast. Don't take it out on Belle. It's not like she stole it. <sighs> I'm sorry. You don't have to apologize. But... Belle... Sora... I want you to leave the castle. Look at me. Look. This is what I am. When you first got here, I tried to change. But I was only fooling myself. I, like, I can't be any stuff. different. Like, ages ago. I'll always be a beast. So I should live oh. like a beast. With no one alone. What is it with Square Enix out there? Goodbye. Way too early. Bell. You can't mean that. I think it's because they were already in dev for it while they were doing the last bit of the Hearts the wine's all made up. Yeah. So they've got a little bit of Look, extra Belle, time, so they've got ahead of the ball, us. so if they can, can the actually announce it he'll calm down. faster, because they've already done some of the work. Because... Square Enix have, a, have announced it's, things way too early. It's... A, also, I think it's uh, gonna be... It's not gonna have a Sora in a lot of it, I don't think, because... Uh, they did say that the um, Kingdom Hearts 3 was kind of the closing to the Xehanort and the last bit of Sora arc. This is characters trying to find Sora, so I don't think there's going to be a lot of Sora gameplay. So they're going to literally just, um, all they've got to do is like update the details on other characters to be able to play. And it's practically just ripping assets from 3 and putting them into 4. Poor child. Okay, you're going to come across some enemies that are called Dragoons, which when they spawn in, yeah, will just drop on you. I'm you want to learn... Dragoon. It's not this. 
you want to defend when they do Ooh. that, and then rapidly press the triangle when you do, and you'll get something called learn, and you'll learn these spear things. You want to get the timing for that down, because Zaldan's boss fight, that's how you're going to do mass damage to him. He's going to have a wind shield that you cannot damage him if you try to attack him. You'll get knocked back, and then his spears will attack you. You defend. When he attacks you with his shield up, a triangle button will come up. Mash, spam it, you'll get something called learn. Get nine of them and then spam them and you'll take off like two of his health bars. Okay. How could it how could I have come to this? And they were so look uh, and they were so looking forward to this evening. Now now we need to uh, we need to no need to be so sad. Once the rose is back safely, this will all be over. What's so special about one rose, anyway? If the master can love and be loved in return, the spell will be broken. He, uh, we'll be all human again. Yeah, you told us. But there is a time limit. He must find his true love before the last petal falls from that rose. Ah, but that is not all. Over time, caring for that rose has become a cherished part of the master's daily life. It's as though all the hopes and dreams are tied to that single bloom. Poor beast! Then we have to get it back. Please do! We can't, uh, we can't without the beast though. If it's that important to him, he's got to do it himself. The lazy fuck. God. Why did why did the master yell at Bell? Would you mind asking him that for me? Yes, but also watch me like oh, you, you're a small tiny teacup. I could stamp you easily. Hey beast. Stop being a bitch. Beast. Persuade. There we go, cutscene. Hey beast! <sighs> oh Leave me have alone. a uh... Come on, you need to hear this. You used to be fearless. You would have given your life to save Bell. No, I don't don't you know what that meant to us? You gave us all courage. I remember. Hmm. Maybe you should have kept some for yourself. I mean, are you really going to throw your happiness away? The rose is your only hope, isn't it? Well, it's the only hope for Cogsworth and the others, too. So don't throw away your last chance. Remember what it was like before Bell lived here? See? You can't give up. Not now. I know one thing. What? This castle belongs to me. Zaldin will never be welcome here. The rumbling rose. That is a very, very good keyblade under certain circumstances. Okay. It's basically, if you're planning on doing one combo at a time, it's powerful. Pum the pumpkin one you've got is the most powerful in the game when you're doing mass amounts of chain combos. So if you're doing like three string combos, the combo gets more powerful as you do it. You're doing like small combos, the rumbling rose is more powerful. Okay. The problem is they're both useless against Zaldin, because you're not going to be using your attacks to fight Zaldin. You're going to be using his own spears against him. I just want to see my... Uh, okay, so that's... Uh... And your level is making me very nervous. What are you talking about? I'm level... 40. That's a good round number. You want to be 55 to 60 for Zaldin. Because he's that much of a cunt. Well, I know how to fuck a... Wait, um... Sir! I am right here. You didn't just insult me. I think I literally one shot you right now. 
Well, I will want to him. Right, you're going into Bell's quarters to see who's to see Bell. Yeah. If you find any of the dragons in Heartless, then you practice. Yeah. Let's go. Auto learn magnets. You learn to use magnets, it knocks every enemy in the air, and you don't have to deal with bullshit enemies like that, they're crimson bastards. Yeah, um, it's overpowered, trust me, you play better, once you play better, once you will see how overpowered it is. Um, you can just keep using it, it's so good. And then the pair with thunder like that, it just destroys. This is why you want to use potions to heal, because then you can cast magnet like again and again and again. Whereas if you use cure, cure is meant as a last ditch, last ditch attempt when you when you're about to run out of magic. You use it when you're about to run out, so then it recharges. You don't waste a whole bar of it like you've been doing. Uh, careful for those enemies, they can kill you right now. Oh, roll away, roll away, roll away from those things. If you roll... Yeah. No, I was going to say, if you roll when that attack comes out, um, the iframes will stop the explosion and you won't take damage if you keep rolling around. If you guys need to switch Donald in, he'll heal you if you get a free heal. Because <laughs> you're not going to be using him in the next fight. He's only with you in the hardest way to do the round. He's just watching you out. I don't know if you can. The fight against Arlen, you're going to be doing all the damage. <laughs> If you take all of his offensive spells off and only have cure on him, he will literally only cure you when you need to. Yes, it basically means that you can use you don't use your magic, he uses his, and you can use your magic for other things. So if you need a second heal in emergency, you have a full MP bar. While you're, when you use, go to use the cure, his will probably refill by the time you use yours, meaning you can chain cures when you need to for emergencies. It's the better option. Take everything but uh, uh, technique attack you can keep on because he needs to. He's, well, he's not going to be attacking anyway because he's not going to have any offensive magic, but just take off the offensive stuff. So, okay, so just turn him all to special set situations. To a, a set, set him to sore attack, and the only thing he will do is cure, because you've, you've told him that he's not allowed to use any of those spells, so he won't do it. Right. All he will do is cure. There you go. So the only thing he can do now is cure when he's got the magic. And I 
that's what you want for the Zarya fight, because if you're going to be doing all the damage, then all you want him on is pure duty. Goofy has uses, because he has some of the most, in some of his spin attacks, can knock enemies in, bosses into the air, so you want to be doing stuff. And there you go, see, Donald healed. That's all he does. Oh, beast. You came after all. Oh, hey. You had me worried. I was afraid you'd given up for good. Don't see the sign, it says no goodies. What do you guys <laughs> really want? Kingdom Hearts. Your favorite, to be fair, I do really like Zaldin. He wants Kingdom when Hearts. When Kingdom Hearts is ours, we can exist fully and completely. So you see, Beast, that's why we need your Heartless and your Nobody. Also, I... I like his eyes, compared to life. These are the enemies. These are the dragoons. Defend. Let, let them do stuff. Defend and, and learn and learn spears. It's great. Wait till it goes in the air and then square. Stand still and square. And then you press triangle when you're close to them and you'll learn you'll learn an uh, you'll learn a spear ability. Oh, you're too far from them. You need to be like... Yeah. Right. Now, you know, what you do is when you're close to them, you use the le you use the spears you learn, then you select the jump command, and then that's what you're gonna do against Zaldin. It's timing. But Zaldin, it's whenever he attacks you, you defend. You're not gonna be able to get through his shield. I think Zaldin is coming up in about a couple of minutes after he's finished dealing with these guys. And obviously make sure you've got healing items on your hot bar and do not use cure. Oh, use your healing items. Probably should have told me that before. Hmm. No, you for the Zaldin fight. Oh right. Oh okay. Do I get a break? You want to keep your emergency cure as a spare, and you want to be able to use spam reflect. So you want to be healing with potions because you're going to be spamming reflect when he unleashes his DM. Yeah, I want to figure out where stuff is. And do not go across that bridge until I've told you. Exactly how we are going to do this fight. Yeah, I'm, just, yeah. I'm trying to figure out how, where, to, where I set stuff because there's so many different things. Items. Yeah. Right. Um, right. 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 Go to items. Sora. Yeah. You've got another thing for another equipment slot. Yeah. Equipment slot. Wait, like, why did you turn reload boost off? What? Keep it on. Reload boost, you turned it off for the items, so it means when they, when they run out, it doesn't automatically reload them. Oh, right. Keep them on. Okay, yeah. Uh, you want anything that your strength? Equipped. I have nothing for strength, so... You do have something for strength. Scroll slowly. None of them boost my strength. Yeah. Mag ma magic strength at the bottom. When you want the power of the magnet, magic, magic to go up. Uh, some some things like reflect. 
it's based on your magic and your strength, so you want magic strength up. Okay, so... So you I'll want the mage. Yeah, okay. Right, how do I change Because we have It's a magic ability, but the damage it deals is based on your strength. I don't think you're going to be able to do so, Alden, I honestly don't. And that's not you, it's, it's, he's an uh, absolute asshole. You're not going to be doing combos, so you can take the pumpkin off, you want. You're not going to be using either Valor or, you're not going to be using any of your drive forms, you're literally just going to be spamming, reflect, and hitting him every okay, now and again, if you take, want anything. Take, take, take. You said take the pumpkin off, but you didn't say what to put it on it. Anything that boosts strength and magic, because you're going to be you. Most of your well, damage is going to be anything. I anything I change is going to be is lower, lower, lower strength. No, the pumpkin's strength stat is based on combo chain. So the strength stat it's displaying on the screen is displaying. The strength is when it says like strength 20 or 30, that's it's uh, telling you how much a combo. If you do the full three line combo, that's how much strength you'll get at the end of the combo. Its strength is based on how many of a combo chain you've got. Okay, Each so hit of that combo is not 30. Yeah, so what, what, it builds. What, yeah. So, what, what, what keyblade do I need to put that in instead? Anything that boots magic that has high strength. So anything okay, so other the than the Yes. Right. Just don't put the pump on because jump commands are not affected by combos because they're not combos. <laughs> okay, cool. That's that. Uh, how do I, again, how do I change my stuff, my abilities, or the things, the hotbar? Um, you go out. Back out. Uh huh. I'm just waiting for the stream to update. I can't see where you are. One second. Right, go back out. Uh huh. Onto the main menu. Wait for the stream to update because I'm slower. Right, go to customize. Ah, I see. Okay, cool. Uh... For ease of convenience, you want cure on X. Oh, okay, I thought I wanted reflect on that, but okay. Reflect on square, because you are. If you get used to pressing square, you only want to press X in an emergency. Mm. No, that doesn't make sense. No. Oh. I don't know. I like. I like. I like it. Okay. You can do it the other way if you want, it's just a lot. I find it easier if you put it on square. Right, so then take off. You don't want Thunderjar on, and you want Cura on your O button, because you will probably also be dodging. Okay, so. That looks good you then. Do want... You want Ethers. On your hot bar, because if you're going to be spamming reflect, so take off mag ma magna, mag magna blah, blah, blah. Yeah. Okay, cool. You want ethers on your hot bar because it re spamming reflect will eat through your e your MP. And um, if you use an ether and don't, if you don't let your e if you use an ether right before your MP is about to run out, like don't let it go into the recharge, you won't have an MP recharge. It'll fill your magic up, but you won't go into recharge. Why are you in the ballroom? Uh, you want to go out towards the bridge where Zalvin is waiting to ambush you. And obviously stop before you get to the bridge because I'm going to tell you how you fight him. Ignore all the enemies, don't bother fucking fighting them, it's just an Ooh. NP and an HP drain right now.
Is that? That's a rose. Look! It's the rose! Heck, let me just put it on top of this the side of this balcony. Look at this <gasps> rose! Oh god, no! It's almost a... Oh! Got your woman. Hurry! Oh no. Now on the bridge. Yeah. I forgot it put you straight onto the fight. With pleasure. But I'd rather travel. Does he get out of that cutscene pause? Because he's gonna go straight for you. Bell or the rose. I think he is. I don't know if it puts you back to the bridge and then lets you run back on, I'm not sure. Good one, Bell! Leg it, Bell, leg it! Oh no, it's putting you straight into the fight, right? Okay. So we need that many spares. Have fun in this. Don't, don't, don't ask, okay? Just pause the game, please. <laughs> Right. So, he, you want to listen to hit what he says. All of his attacks are telegraphed by words, and because you're not going to be attacking him, you need to know what attack he's doing. So he's about, he's got his windshield up. He's going to slowly walk towards you, and then he's going to get his spears to attack you. You want to block the guard and then mash triangle when he does. You will learn those spear things to jump. You want to back away, and then when he starts, he will start walking towards you again, and you want to do that until you've got nine. Once you've got nine, and he's not going to attack you anymore, and you're close enough, do the jump command and do that. Then back off. He sh is win one of two things will happen. His windshield will fall, or you'll do enough damage to put him in DM. If his windshield falls... Good luck, if you can't do it, just I'll do it. Trust me, it's uh, it's complicated this fight. Yes, I don't, I I don't see you beating this fight at your level, I really don't. If he disappears off the screen, wait till he appears on the screen again, and then start mashing um, Reflect because he's going into his DM and you'll know because a giant dragon will appear. Hitting him, you can't, you can't damage him with physical attack when his shield is up. That's why he's walking towards you. You've got to shoot to hit him. That's why you've got a guard, because you can't hit him. <laughs> this is why I said match the jump command is the only way you can damage him. 
Good. Okay, there you go. And off you go. There you go. Now you know how to fight Darlene. What? Oh. Oh, jump and fly away. Jump and fly away from that. You can glide away from that. Oh, I forgot that on this on this game it's uh oh just jump away, just jump away, just jump away, you can jump. Or you can just reflect. That that works too. Reflect no. Oh dodge. Yeah. If it helps, all of his abilities, apart from his DMs, you can guard all of them. Last triangle as you jump. You're not even locked on. Um, no, 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 no. Okay, you're. You're in range to trigger his DM, don't hit him, don't, don't physically hit him with your keyblade, you will trigger the DM. He's most likely gonna start doing it now, and he does spam it. He can spam it every 30 seconds if once he gets low enough. Oh, here he goes, here he goes, here he goes, here he goes, here he goes. Get away from him, get away from him, get away from him. Uh, you'll go underneath the thing, you'll come back up and start. Spam reflect, spam reflect, spam reflect. away from dying if you hit him with magic. As soon as you get your MP bar back, use a potion and then if you hit him with any magic spell while you're locked onto him, 
he should die. Otherwise, you'll have to get a full combo on him. Oh, look, there he goes. Well done. That was a very stressful fight. I think you were going to do that because you only supposed to be 55 to 60 to fight him. And now the only real boss that's going to pose you a challenge is in the world that ever was at the beginning. And you will not do that fight the first time, I can guarantee you that. We get the rose and then there's a... there's a heart. Oh, no, Here, it's, it's yours again. Bell. I know. You want me to leave the castle. <sighs> what matters is... You weren't hurt by Zaldan. You're safe. Oh, well, my intellect just decided to be a dick. I'm very grateful to you for bringing the rose back to me. Hmm. Thank you. It's the least I could do. You've been good to me, and you didn't have to be. Listen, Belle. Yes? <sighs> Oh. Say it. Go on. Come on. You can do it. We have confidence. Just to say you're Don't be bashful, man. Not yep. tomorrow. Oh, God damn it. I was going to offer to Well, I'd like you to tomorrow. stay with me. Please. Nah, uh, breakfast is provided for. Mm hmm. Uh. I will. My strong music. The weather's really messing with my internet the last couple of days. It just doesn't like it. Hey, did you see the look on Belle's face when she grabbed that rose? Huh? Yup, she sure was having fun, all right. She is rather unique, isn't she? Always ready for a little adventure. The two of them do seem made for each other. Yeah, they sure do. Beast's Castle. Three trophies today in school, and then oh, it's unlocked. And oh. what's that? That what's this? Thing? That big thing? Maybe that's the source of the weird reading we picked up before. And there's something funny about Twilight Town. I'm seeing two of them. Look, it's another huge energy reading, and it's coming from some place near the town. I don't know what's going on, fellas, but it sure looks like there's some big trouble brewing around Twilight Town. I'm gonna save it and then pull it out. Keep. Cute. So we'll play some more Wednesday. Yeah. Cool. Now I say. Yeah, for now I say, live long and prosper.